Hello and welcome to Fox 17 Unfiltered. I'm Max Goldwasser. With all this cooler weather, I think the last thing people might be thinking about is ice cream. Although I bet Barbara here at the Holland Momentum Center would beg to differ. Ice Absolutely. cream is never a bad thing to think about. Ice cream is good all year round, any weather. Uh, that's what I've learned about West Michigan. People really, really seem to love their ice cream here. Absolutely. <laughs> Just about everywhere you look, there's an ice cream shop. and I. I'd be hard pressed to find any, anyone that's newer than the one that you guys have created here at the Holland Momentum Center, fittingly named the Momentum Ice Cream Parlor. Love a good pun. That's right. Uh, you guys just opened March 13th, about a month ago. What was the goal with this? Well, the goal was to supplement the work we do as a nonprofit here in Holland. So we work with people with mental illness, addictions, and disabilities. It costs a dollar a year to be a member at the Momentum Center. And then we fill the need between the individual and clinical care. We started in Grand Haven. And in Grand Haven, we have a cafe, which offers a place for public integration with our members instead of more isolation. And that's the piece we were missing in Holland. What have you learned in the month's time that this has been up and running? We've learned that people love country dairy ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> and they love a good deal. Our ice cream is a dollar a scoop. Uh, we've learned that we have amazing neighbors in the right here in the neighborhood who come in with their kids and enjoy ice cream. Uh, we've learned that our, our members appreciate the opportunity to experience cold goodness. You had me at a dollar a scoop. <laughs> <laughs> this was the final step in making the Holland Momentum Center a true momentum center. What exactly does that mean? Well, community has to go beyond our four walls, right? It has to be about the larger community around us. And so the ice cream shop invites the community in so that we're creating integration. Without that kind of integration and community interaction, what might happen for the 217 plus members that you have here. What can happen otherwise is we inadvertently create more isolation. We start talking about that place being for those people, as opposed to recognizing that all of us are dealing with something at some point. And so we really want to break down those, those stigmas and those stereotypes that would say that there are certain people uh, who fit certain categories. We're all in this together. What's it like for you to watch that interaction happen? Oh, it's wonderful. It's it, building relationships is the key to happiness, right? We all need to be in relationship with each other and to be an agent to help that take place is incredibly rewarding. And we're seeing the impact. We know that our members are experiencing a statistically significant change in depression, anxiety, loneliness, and social connectedness. Uh, it works. Speaking of building relationships, I think it's time we build a relationship with some of this ice cream over Absolutely. here. Absolutely. Can't do a story about ice cream without at least tasting the product. So <laughs> what do we got over here? We got a few options. Yeah, we do. Uh, Country Fresh Dairy. Uh, we have their traditional grandpa's vanilla, butter pecan. Mm -hmm. We have our strawberry, simply chili chocolate. This is my favorite. This is like a mine or an Incan chocolate with spice and some heat to it. It's amazing. I've never heard of, of spice being <laughs> incorporated into chocolate. Gonna have to try it though. It's it's amazing. Yeah. Let's get some scooping going. All right. There's and a it's cone. one dollar a scoop again. So a dollar a scoop. That's a tough deal to beat. There's Thank a you. scoop for you. Is there a specific kind of form from the expert herself that I should be using to uh, just scoop a the lot ice cream. of elbow grease. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I can make that work. I hope it's not too hard. <laughs> okay. Do you want what, to do you want What are to, you scooping up? Uh, I mean you talked about the, the, the spicy ice cream, the chili chocolate. All Typically right. I'd go butter crunch pecan, that's my favorite but gotta try something you've new. You sold me on this. Alright let's get that elbow grease working. Yep. Well oh, done! Not bad. Look at that! That's beautiful! I'd say that's picture perfect. All huh? right, well, I think I need to join you. All right. That looks perfect. Hey, cheers on that. Cheers. At this point, you're only open two days a week. Right. Monday and Friday for a few hours. Monday from 3 to 7, Friday from 11 to 2. And we want to expand those hours. It's just a matter of getting volunteers who are willing to help us serve ice cream. And mm -hmm. then we'll be open more and more. Hey, you get to work right next to what is very good chocolate. I just took my Did first bite. Did you take it? Yeah. Isn't that yummy? I forgot where my train of thought was going because the, the taste of this distracted me. It's a good, 
it's a good sign. It's so good. Mm -hmm. It's so good. Mm -hmm. And this is such a fun place to volunteer. You get a free ice cream cone when you volunteer as well. Sold. <laughs> <laughs>